Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Railway Empire. I'm Nexus. Uh, well, and the last time we played this, it was undergoing some serious uh, updates and bug fixes and new developments and all kinds of stuff. And it looks like they have a new sandbox mode available, which is pretty cool. And a free mode. Um, I think we did campaign last time, and what we're going to do is sandbox mode. Yay! Okay, so sandbox mode. It looks like we can choose from different um, times or different uh, sections of the map. And then I was looking around, we have an actual sandbox mode here that's a, um, excuse me, a random map. Got France, which I don't have. Uh, we have Germany, which I don't have. Uh, Great Britain, which we don't have. And South America, which we don't have. And the Great Lakes, which we don't have. Interesting. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that we don't have. Uh, anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to do sandbox mode in the whole of America. Right? So why don't you take five seconds to enjoy the intrepid intro, and we'll get today's agenda underway. All right, folks, welcome back. So I've been looking around. looks like we can start in different eras. And I think we're going to go ahead and just start in uh, 1830 to 1930, the first hundred years. And, ooh, let's see. Initial capital, there isn't one. Starting city, Atlanta. Uh, let's try to start somewhere that's not so mountainous. That looks like a nice place. Why don't we start there? Because, uh, rail network, trains must wait for each other. You will need parallel track switches and signals. Pause mode. You can pause the game at any time by pressing the space bar, but you will receive a deduction on your rating at the complete, on the completion screen. The game pauses automatically when building tracks. The game never pauses other than newspapers. And, all right, so we can pause it if we need to. We'll do manual pause. And it looks like we're pretty limited on the options that we can do here because it's sandbox mode. So we're going to go ahead and start in St. Louis. And that will give us access to all of these cities without having to go through the mountain ranges and stuff. And then as we progress and advance uh, with more money and better trains, we can start uh, setting up lines that will actually take us through all of the other stuff. So without further ado, let's get that underway. Together, we shall conquer them all. <laughs> we'll send them home in body uh, oh. send them packing. Okay, growing up in an immigrant quarters of the New York, Don Lo okay, Don Lorenzo, so charming, five auctioneers at the start of the game, no applications from office employees, fifteen percent less income from passengers and mail, fifteen percent more income from freight. Well we won't be doing freight right away. Planning, tables, figures. You're not seriously considering these other nitwits, are you? 70% more? God. It doesn't matter what you do, just do it with style. We'll just wrap them all around our little finger. Strong leadership and discipline are the path to victory. Uh, 20% less track construction costs. We'll go with the general. It's fine, it'll be okay. Now, I know some of you have mentioned in the comments about me bringing back railway or um now bringing this game back imagination run wild unlimited cash can we turn that stuff down because you guys are just too flipping loud um voice turn that crap down i don't need to it doesn't need to be that loud there, there's no point for it uh, competitors don't need to be that loud come on come on there you go. Uh, no obligation and no annoying competitors. Well, wait a minute. Is the sandbox mode the unlimited mode? Because I don't want to do that. Oh no, the money is unlimited. Okay, so this isn't what we're going to be doing. Ah. Uh, um. Let's go back. What a bother. Uh, what's free mode? Uh, let's go back to St. Louis. Pause mode normal, AI level normal, rail network realistic, competitors, we'll do three. Initial capital, one million. Okay, there we go. This is what we want, is free mode, not sandbox mode. Sorry, folks. That was a little bad on bad uh, bad decision on my part. I didn't actually read the rules before we started the game, but uh, good thing we caught it in the beginning. All right. So first thing we want to do 
Your company has just been founded, your startup capital transferred, and your list of tasks created. But beware of the three opponents. Yeah, my three opponents. All right, build your first two stations. So I think I want to go from... Oh... Why don't we just go from St. Louis to Chicago? Because there's not, we don't have to make any bridges or anything like that. i got to remember how to play this game. Albuquerque, businesses, stations. There we go, stations. No, no, no. Cities. Okay, i got to remember how to do this. Okay, here we go. Yep, that's right. Uh, small train station. We'll start with we'll start with that because that's always a good idea. Uh, rotate is uh, shift control. Uh, okay. Well, trying to figure out how to rotate here. Uh, reduce rotation speed. Ah, there we go. That's right. You got to hold shift and then use the mouse wheel. Perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Uh, I want to put, I think I want to put the station on the outskirts of town, to be honest. Um, let's turn it around this way, because I, yeah, there we go. I want tracks to be able to be built on the outside, on the outer outskirts of town. And we will put this first one right there. Ah, there we go. Ah, perfect. All right, and then the next one can go, oh, somewhere... Do I want to go there? No, we don't want to take out the buildings. All right, let's let's see. Can we do it this way? We could. Uh, maybe we need to just put it right through the center of town. No, the station must be built within the city or close to rural business in the country. All right, well, let's move around and kind of see how we can. Reduce. Alright, trying to figure out how to get the station in here to make it the most of it. Um, wonder if we do it like right there. There we go. Per perfect. Now let's grab some track. Uh, there we go. Alright, there's that. And there's that. And, uh,. Where are we going? We're going to here. Boom. All right. Bang, bang, bang. Okay. Pay for it. Aha. All right. There's that. And then now I know that we're going to need like, uh, we're going to need the things to refill. So let's grab uh, a supply tower. Okay. Put one there. See, I remember some things. And then put one there. Works for me. This way they can re resupply their water and sand and all the, and coal and all that kind of stuff. Alright, now let's go to that and go buy an engine. Set up a rail line. Um, from here to Chicago. Right. No, I'm not. I'm not doing that. We're not going that way. Confirm route and exit mode. Yes, confirm the route. Changes made to rail line. Uh, add the locomotive. Oh no, no, no. That's all we got. Seriously. All right. Well, I guess we're gonna buy this. Close. Come down here. Ah, oh, the controls. The mouse controls are ridiculous. Can we... That's what we want. There we go. Oh, no, it's one of those games. I forgot. You can't actually ride along. Yeah, we can. But I don't like the ride along. I like the other mode. Toggle camera. Leave. There we go. Oh. It's so close. There we go. We can pull back. All right, so... This little shunter thing is going to be our mainstay for probably a little bit anyway. And then uh, once we get another another new locomotive, we'll be able to haul even more stuff. So it looks like we're carrying passengers and mail. Hello, Chicago. First train of the era. 
Congratulations. The citizens are overjoyed. Even more so than they were in St. Louis. Haha. -ha. Come on, come on. Fill it up, fill it up. Oh, we got... Oh, look at all those passengers. It's a full load. My goodness, look at all the cars. That looks wonderful. All right. So we're going to follow this along and let it do its thing. And while this is doing it, once we get back down here, we'll set in another rail line. Because I think we're going to need more than one to get us started. Which will always be wonderful things to do. Look at all those train cars. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 16 rail cars, and that little shunter is pulling them all. 15 miles an hour, but, you know, that's better than nothing. For beginners and dreamers, sweetie. Get out of here, blondie. Ain't nobody worried about you. I've got a handle on things, and things are going to be magnificent and marvelous at the same time. Don't you talk to me about how to do things. All right, let's go over here. <laughs> What's this? Whenever a train reaches the city, freight, mail, and passengers will be unloaded. The rising numbers represent transport revenue. The faster you transport express goods, the higher the revenues. Okay, so the faster we transport, the more money we make, not the longer we transport. All right, so now what we should probably do is try and look at maybe setting up a second rail line over here to Indianapolis. Was that lightning? Yes, it was. Oh, my gosh. Holy moly. And close that out. And where can we put the station here? Next train. No, I didn't, I didn't want to do that. Stop, game. You're, make, you're, you're making a mess of things. I don't appreciate it at all. Let's grab us as a station. And switch it around. And let's get it pretty close. Shebang. There we go. Alright. Yeah, I gotta beat you, don't I? You over there talking all that mess. Oh, what are we, where are we going? No, 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 no. Oh, I, I'm still getting control, used to the controls. Yeah, yeah, I didn't need to read that, did you? It's just telling us that the competitors are trying to, they're trying to be snaky. No, clear the planning. Grab the track. Grab the track. My goodness. Goodness me. Smack that in there. Pay for it. And it's a done deal. Um, Alright, so. Now. We're going to need to upgrade this. Yep. There we go. Ha! A Wunderba. Alright. Now, where's the bulldozer? There it is. We can bulldoze this. Ooh, refund. Refund. Okay. And then we want to go from this side over here. Bang. There we go. Pay for it. Get it lined in. And then we will come over here. And uh, we'll close this out. And we'll say... Add a line from here, from Indianapolis. And we'll push another train into Chicago. Right. Um, click that. And then buy a locomotive. That's all we've got right now. Grasshopper. Indianapolis or Chicago. Uh, right. Grab that. There we go. That's St. Louis, we need to go over here. Um, we need to get in here and say we need a supply tower. And then we need another supply tower. There we go. It's like, hey, why aren't we going? You didn't put a supply tower in. You're right, I didn't. I apologize. I apologize. Are we carrying how much? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight kegs of beer. Look at those kegs. Wow, I didn't realize that kegs were that big. They don't even look like kegs. They look like water tower tops. At any rate, it's doing what we needed to do. Haul them kegs. 
And then water tower tops full of beer. Everybody needs to be absolutely drunk at all times in the cities because uh, then they make stupid decisions and have to pay us and have to pay fines, which make us more money. That is a horrible way to look at it, but a way to look at it nonetheless. Come on, come on, come on. Increases the reliability of your locomotive by 6%. Uh, I'll buy it just because. Did you bring your big wallet with you? I sure did. Are you jealous? You sure sounded like it there, Blondie. Alright, so that's that. Uh... There we go. Game speed will increase to times two speed. I guess there's only a, there's there's go and then there's times two, which is cool. We we can get down with that. What are you carrying? Oh, look at all that meat. Uh huh. I like meat. You like meat? Everybody likes meat. That looks like a big old T-bone steak. I'll take five of those if you don't mind. Uh, two in one sitting if you don't mind. Okay, so beer and some passengers. Sounds good to me. We'll just kind of do this thing, kind of watch the trains go back and forth. Express line in danger. Uh-oh. Why? Oh, yeah, I got a... Where is it? Where is it? Um... Railway buildings. Industries. Uh, let's slow this down. Express line in danger as faster locomotive is available. Okay. Well, then let's get the faster locomotive. Uh, buy locomotive. But there's not a faster one available. Why does it keep telling me that there is? I think the game is off its marbles. Constructed. You want to construct a maintenance building. Yes. And this is new train, add a locomotive. I thought you said there was a new one available. They're they're both the same. It it doesn't it, it doesn't make any sense. Um What's this? Manage train. Okay. Are we sure that's what we wanted to do? New rail line. Alright. Not exactly sure what that did. City state. Build city stations in the center to attract the many passengers. Oh. Well, I didn't know that. Well, we'll do that on the. We'll do that in other cities. Right now, we're just going to go ahead and go with the fact that they're on the outskirts and not move it because uh, that would be horrible. Um, there's a maintenance building in the middle. I don't think we need an extra one, although I could be wrong about that. Train station signaling control terminal big stick warehouse a maintenance station. Interest. Ooh. Wow, look at that. Holy moly. Okay, well, we're not going to buy that. Not just yet, anyway. We've got some major stuff to be doing before we start doing all of that. How do we get rid of this? There we go. Train load. So, Professor. Um, a bandit. Yeah, I'll buy you. Yeah, cool. And uh, Naomi Moore. I don't know if we need one of those. Yeah, no. Um, we'll say this train. Manage the train. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how we use the bandit. Oh, we got cabooses. Nice. And a mail car, dining car, refrigerator car. None of that stuff's researched yet, though. Balance per month. We're making about four grand. Four point four grand a month. That's not too bad. It could be worse. It could be better too, arguably. Where are you guys going? Exp 
expand the station. No, I don't want to do that yet. We don't think we don't need to. We just need to keep doing what we're doing, making the little bit of money that we're making. Welcome to the exciting railroad business. Innovations are available. Research. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Yep. Oh, this new locomotive looks impressive. It does, doesn't it? Thank you for noticing. Uh, first you need to unlock one more innovations. Okay. We're acquiring 164 or more innovation points in this area. Lovely. Okay, well, we got the first thing researched, which means we get a new locomotive. Now, if we go down here... I don't know where the train's at. There it is. Managed train. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking. Alright. Awesome sauce. Passengers and mail. Wonderful. The best things in the world, passengers and mail, pay lots and lots of money. Actually, I think freight pays more, but we're not going to argue about it. All right. Pretty cool, I have to say. Now, do we want to? We don't want to do that to that train yet, do we? Do we want to? Do we want to do that? Thirty-one thousand, which means refund of twenty-nine thousand. Okay, let's do it. All right. All right, cool. But uh, unfortunately, I think that's going to wrap it up today. So thank you very much for joining me. If you enjoyed this one, please leave me a like and a comment. Hit the red subscribe button if you've not done so already. The chaos is mightier than the sword on my channel. If you're new here and a regular, you know this, and that's why you're here. And if you're not, um, I'm sorry, if, you, <laughs> if you're not new here and you're a regular, you know this, and that's why you're here. If you're new here and would like to see more of this kind of chaos of, in this variety, I recommend to hit the red subscribe button at this time. I've been Nexus. This has been Railway Empire. Thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.